Hello my dear friends, welcome back to NCGAN. Today in this video we have another very very interesting algebraic equation. So let's get started straight away. I can see 3x minus 2 is written there, 4x minus 3 is written there, 6x minus 5 is there, 12x minus 11 is there. So we can write equation 3x minus 2 can be written as minus 3 plus 1. Similarly, 4x minus 3 can be written as 4x minus 4 plus 1. Then for the third bracket 6x minus 5 we can write 6x minus 6 plus 1. And last bracket we will be writing 12x minus 12 plus 1. RHS is 2. Now we can take 3 common here. 4 is common here. 6 is common here. 12 is common here. So we can write 3 times x minus 1 plus 1. This is our bracket number 1. For second bracket 4 times x minus 1 plus 1. For third bracket we will take 6 common out in the bracket x minus 1 will be there. Then after plus 1. And then we will write 12 is common in the bracket x minus 1. Then we will write plus 1 and RHS is 2. Now let us assume x minus 1 equal to u. So our equation will be in u. I will write 3u plus 1. Then we will write 4u plus 1. Then we will write 6u plus 1. Then we have 12u plus 1, RHS is 2. Now I will multiply these brackets 1, 2, 3. Here I will be multiplying with 4. So that 4 times 3 will give us 12. So I need to multiply here with 3. So that 3 times 4 will be 12. Here we will be multiplying with 2. We will be getting the same product 12. Here it is already 12. So we have multiplied 4 times 3 times 2. Overall it is 24 in LHS. So I need to multiply 24 in the RHS also. So we can write our equation 4 times 3u plus 1. 12u plus 4. 3 times 4u plus 1. 12u plus 3. 2 times 6u plus 1, 12u plus 2, then we have 12u plus 1, RHS is 48. Now you can see 12u, 12u, 12u and 12u. So better is to consider 12u equal to A suppose. So a plus 4 times a plus 3 times a plus 2 times a plus 1 equal to 48. Let me write a plus 4 times a plus 3 times a plus 2 times a plus 1 equal to 48. Now if I will add 4 and 1 then this is equal to 3 plus 2. So we will combine these two brackets and we will combine these two brackets. So let me write here a plus 1 times a plus 4 and then we will multiply a plus 2 times a plus 3. RHS is 48. Let's multiply these two first. We will write a square. 4a plus a, 5a, 1 times 4 is 4. Now we will multiply these two brackets and we can write a square, 3a plus 2a is 5a, 2 times 3 is 6, equal to 48. Now you can see 4 and 6. So 4 can be written as 5 minus 1. 
and 6 can be written as 5 plus 1. So I will write a square plus 5a plus 5 then minus 1. In other bracket a square plus 5a plus 5 plus 1 equal to 48. Now if I will consider a square plus 5a plus 5 equal to m and 1 equal to n m here we will write n then we have m minus n times m plus n here we can write m square minus n square so we can write our lhs a square plus 5a plus 5 whole square minus 1 whole square let me write here a square plus 5a plus 5 whole square minus 1 whole square equal to 48. Or we can write a square plus 5a plus 5 whole square minus 1 square is minus 1. I will take to the RHS. We can write 48 plus 1 will be equal to 49, will be equal to 7 square. So I can write a square plus 5a plus 5 whole square will be equal to 7 whole square. Now we can consider square roots both sides. So a square plus 5a plus 5, this will be equal to plus minus 7. So I can write two equations from here. a square plus 5a plus 5 equal to plus 7 and a square plus 5a plus 5 equal to negative 7. So we will be having two quadratic equations. I will write a square plus 5a 5 minus 7 is minus 2 equal to 0. This is our first quadratic equation. And second equation we will write a square plus 5a plus 5 plus 7. So plus 12 equal to 0. So we have finally two quadratic equations which we will solve one by one. Let me write here a square plus 5a minus 2 equal to 0. Now we will apply quadratic formula minus b plus minus the square root of b square minus 4ac over 2 times a. As per our quadratic equation, if I will write the value of a, it is coefficient of small a square 1, b will be equal to 5, c will be constant negative 2. Let's find out a, a will be equal to minus 5 plus minus a square root of 5 a square is 25 minus 4 times 1 times minus 2. So I can write here plus 8 divided by 2 times 1, so 2. So I can write here minus 5 plus minus a square root of 33 over 2. This is value of A. Now we will consider our second quadratic equation. A square plus 5A plus 12 equal to 0. In this case, a is 1, B is 5 and C is 12. So I can write the value of A will be equal to minus 5 plus minus the square root of 5 square is 25 minus 4 times 1 times 12, 48 over 2 times 1 is 2. 
So 25 minus 48 is minus 23. So I can write here a equal to minus 5 plus minus the square root of minus 23 over 2 will be equal to minus 5 plus minus the square root of minus 1 is i. So I can write directly i times the square root 23 over 2. So we have four a values. If I will write values of a minus 5 plus minus the square root of 33 over 2. And here we will write minus 5 plus minus i times the square root 23 over 2. Now we will write our substitutions. A was 12u. So in this place I can write equal to 12u. Let me write here 12u equal to minus 5 plus minus is square root 33 over 2 minus 5 plus minus i times is square root 23 over 2. Now we will divide both sides by 12. We will get the value of u will be minus 5 plus minus the square root 33 over 2 times 12, 24. Minus 5 plus minus i times the square root 23 over 2 times 12, which is 24. Now u was our substitution if I will write x minus 1 was u. So in place of u we will write x minus 1. Now I need to add 1 to both sides. To collect our final answer I will write x will be equal to minus 5 plus minus square root 33 over 24 plus 1. Here also minus 5 plus minus i times the square root 23 over 24 plus 1. So we will be getting our final answer if I will write. Once we will take LCM, x will come out. Minus 5 plus 24 is 19. So 19 plus minus the square root 33 over 24. So first two solutions and the remaining two would be minus 5 plus 24 is again 19 plus minus i times the square root 23 divided by 24. So here we have two real and two complex solutions. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Goodbye.